Hello, people of the YouTube. Welcome back to another Minecraft video on my realm server currently. Um, today I'm going to. I'm accompanied by. Tyrus Fox 26 again. <laughs> his name will be. His um. Your channel will be in the description below if you want to check out him. He posts like daily videos on Minecraft and stuff. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um. um later on, I, I will have to get a better um. <clears throat> Uh, a better mic. I will have to get a uh, and a, a new desk too. So, and I'll, I'll possibly getting be getting fraps. So, in in the near future, I will be doing better and more frequent uploads. Yeah. So. So today in Minecraft, what I'm going to show you is how to kill a specific entity within a particular region. Now it's very simple, and it's. You is um how you do this is using the slash kill ID command. Now, when you're in normal Minecraft and you cherish animals around you and your chunk, never do slash kill ID. Because that kills every single entity and animal, meaning paintings, torches like torch particles, but I don't get really they don't really do much, but yeah. And then you want to do slash kill ID, but then put a bracket right after it and do name equals and then whatever name of the mob that you want to kill. For this example, I have a dinner bone chicken hidden within all these chickens right here. And you see it's like upside down. And I want to kill that chicken in particular because, you know, he has a, he has um, malaria. No, he has, he has the flu and all the chickens don't want to get the flu. So uh, we have to kill him because we don't want our chicken to get spoiled and nasty. And to get malaria. Not malaria. That was a bad example. I meant the flu. So, um, we do slash kill Addy, and then name equals dinner bone. Bracket name equals dinner bone. You would think, yeah, I think so. Make sure you do the bracket. Yeah. And then when you press enter, it kills that one chicken, which was dinner bone. So now all your chickens, um, food supply will not have malaria. The flu. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And also, another thing I want to show you is how to summon in, like, how to spawn in player heads, specific player heads, into your Minecraft world. So, this it's just a give command that you do, which is slash give whoever Minecraft skull one space three curly bracket. Skull owner, and then whatever name for for this, I'm going to use Turkey Sandwich. So as you see, I got Turkey Sandwich's head, and yeah, it's all good. Our recruit's head. Mhm. Mm and yeah, so. It has to be it's case sensitive, obviously. So you could do like grum. I think that's how you spell it. And uh, dinner bone, and all this, all this lovely stuff. So that's what I basically did for the spawn, as you saw in the other video. So yeah, guys, that's all I. <laughs> that's all I basically. Now remember, to tell you. for this command, you also have to put every single thing that's in this chat. That just popped up. You cannot copy and paste it. You have to write. You have to type this by hand. Okay. <laughs> this whole thing that you see in the chat, right below Grum's head, you have to do, put all that in a command block if you want to, or in the oh, chat. On on my side, I can't see that. I have my chat settings, my chat scale. All right, all right, hold on. You'll see just a second. Doesn't matter. It's just a giant. It's it's useless. It's just a joke. It's a giant command. <laughs> yeah, it was right there. That's why I turned my chat off. Spam some chat. Well. Let me, let me scale down. And you know what we're gonna do now? The end of the episode. <laughs> no copy. Chicken on chicken. So, if you did enjoy, guys, please leave a like, 
subscribe, comment for more videos in the near future. And what we'll do now for the outro, burn the chickens! We'll die in hell tonight. That's my thumbnail. <laughs> Oh, Alright, yes. bye. Chicken for everyone.